Hi everybody, this is tolifan.net and this video is an iCustom application tutorial so uh, we will see in this video how you can add on your home screen some shortcut icons with customized icon and text to launch your favorite apps like for example Twitter you may have seen this in uh, my previous presentation video for iCustom so let's see how to do that uh, just go to the iCustom website from Safari it's just a website so type iCustom.toolhyphen.net on the Safari address bar so you're on the on the home screen of iCustom uh, tap start now menu and you're on the main configuration page uh, you have some help section Read it carefully, it's very useful and contextual help section for each item. Okay, with uh, many informations. So basically, you just have to choose an application type. So, all applications, there are about 100 applications available uh, for the moment, pre configured. Uh, or you can choose uh, some uh, category of applications, like for example, social and sharing. Next, you choose the application itself. Uh, for social apps, we have Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Dropbox. Let's choose uh, Dropbox. OK. And next, uh, you can type here any uh, URL address to any image, image uh, file on the web to use uh, as your custom icon. Or uh, if you want to upload a photo from your photo library, you can tap this button. Uh, you just have to, to download the pickup application before on the App Store. So tap the upload button, it launches the pickup app. And uh, we can choose a photo from our photo library. OK. For example, for Dropbox, I will use this icon. OK. Tap upload. So the file is uploading. Uh, online to the IMG URL uh, file sharing system. I don't know if the accent is correct, but you can see here the address of your image uploaded on IMG UR website. Uh, the photo is not square, so you, you have a warning, don't worry. And you have an icon preview showing that everything is okay, uh, your icon has been found. You can choose to add or not some glossy effect on the icon. We will uh, let this. And the possibility to, to let an empty title on it. OK. Tap the Let's Go button. So you're on a page with many instructions of what to do next. Uh, you just have, in fact, to tap this button on Safari Mobile. You can see your icon with the glossy effect. Tap Add to Home Screen. And here you can uh, just tap Add to add the icon of your home screen if you want to let an empty text or you can type any text you want. For example, Dropbox and uh, with an emoticon keyboard, you can put a little cloud inside. Drop box. OK, X. Where is the X? Here. So you have your icon name, custom icon, type add. And the icon appears on your home screen. And then uh, you just have to tap it to launch the Dropbox application. It's very easy, as you see. Dropbox app. And uh, if I tap Dropbox again, it launches again. It's really a shortcut for your application, but you can put a custom icon and a custom text. OK, uh, as um, other native iOS apps, you will find it if you choose the full screen mode in the taskbar. And you can see that the iCustom icon launches a real Dropbox application. So it's just a, a shortcut. OK, and uh, like other iOS apps, you can long tap it and delete it if you don't want it anymore on your home screen. Okay, so 
we just saw how to add a custom application icon on your home screen. In uh, next videos we will see how to do other stuff like put shortcuts to call, SMS, email uh, some people or use the another browser than Safari to launch websites. Okay, thank you for watching this video. Uh, don't forget to thumbs up the video and uh, go on the YouTube channel to see other video. This is iCustom by toolhyphen.net. Goodbye.